Hey everybody, today's question is, should every heavy deadlift look shitty? And I think the answer is no, but it takes a lot of work, right? So oftentimes what we say is, you know, you're, you're testing your one rep max and those one reps never, those singles never look too good, right? You're, you're usually losing positions here. I think that the goal should be perfect technique on those heavy reps, right? It's okay to not have that in the process, and it's not something to get too worried about, unless you can de um, definitely identify some sort of problem associated with doing it that way. But I think that if I'm training the proper patterns, positions, movements all throughout my years, like if I've been doing this really, really well for the last 10 years, then I can do some pretty heavy reps with some pretty good technique, heavy relative to the person, right? Not relative to the earth because everybody is different. But what we're testing is, am I improving? Am I doing well for myself? Okay, so I don't think all your singles need to look like crap. I'm trying not to say the S word again. I don't think they all need to look bad. I think you should have this intent of good technique, right? Nine out of 10, 10 out of 10, making sure I'm feeling it in the right places, making sure I'm bringing the hips, making sure I don't lose my positions, right? And do that over the long term. Do that for your six rep sets, for your three rep sets, for your singles, for your doubles, anything, right? You need to be able to build the, your physiology in those rep ranges with those weights and during these movements. If you're ever gonna learn how to maintain that during heavier reps, right? I need to get used to fatiguing so that I can hold my position when the weight is really, really heavy. So just some thoughts.